I noticed you sitting there across the cafeteria. I knew there wouldn't be another chance like this, so I approached you. I noticed your long, dark, brown hair, your bright smile, and your milky hazel eyes. I like how easy you are to talk to, how we were talking for hours until the manager had to kick us out. I like how you responded to my flirting, how you laughed at my corny jokes just because you thought I was cute. I liked how you allowed a stranger to walk you home, even if it was just a block away. I also noticed you had your phone out, so I saw this as an opportunity to ask for your number. I noticed how you waited an hour to reply to my messages, just so you wouldn't seem desperate, and how you made it sound like you had plans when you really just didn't want me to know that you were home alone on a Friday night. I noticed how all of our phone calls were over two hours long, and we could go on and on talking about nonsense. How we would base ending the call on whoever falls asleep first. Some days, I would even wake up and notice that my phone was still on from the night before. I noticed that all I really wanted at the time was to know more about you. All I wanted to do was hang out with you. I noticed how whenever I was around you, I would get goosebumps and butterflies in my stomach. I also noticed my deep and strong feelings going more and more for you, and so I asked you to be my girlfriend. I then noticed how comfortable we were fully expressing our love towards one another, whether it was physically or verbally, and eventually I started to fall in love with you. I would notice us expressing our love whenever it was possible, giving soft kisses and holding your hand whenever I could. I loved how your fingers fit perfectly between mine. I trusted you with anything and everything. We practically did everything together. We saw each other every day and went out with each other almost every weekend. I noticed how we've taken about a thousand pictures together. Wherever you would go, I would be by your side. I noticed how we were two flames burning like a perfect match. But that was the thing. We simmered down. I noticed how comfortable we were becoming with each other. Like how you could rip in front of me like it was nothing. Or how we could dress poorly whenever one of us would come over. I noticed that whenever you would text me, I would no longer immediately reply. I would hold you off. Then when I would make plans, you would say no to me for your friends last minute. I noticed that you went out with your friends a lot more. I'm not sure why the sudden change. I noticed that our perfect match was running out of time. I started to notice us arguing a lot more and how we would try to make up with a simple apology, but it wouldn't work every time. Eventually one fight became two, two became four, four became ten, and soon enough we were arguing every day. I noticed us getting mad over silly, small, and minor things. I noticed you were talking to other guys. At first I didn't mind, but then it got too personal. Fighting became a routine, yelling was normal, and swearing was a habit. I noticed I was no longer happy. I noticed you stopped holding my hand when we'd cross the street, and how we would never go anywhere nice anymore. I noticed how you stopped saying I love you before we would go to sleep, or how you stopped doing all the little things for me. Loving someone and appreciating someone are two very different things. I'm not so sure why you stopped doing both. After our sixth night arguing in a row, I asked you if we could sit down and reevaluate our relationship. I noticed that when we met up, your facial expression changed drastically when you saw me. I no longer saw a happy and bright face. I saw how you avoided eye contact when I speak to you. How you would move your chair just so it was further away from me. I simply told you that the love in our relationship was gone. 
It was fading and breaking out into a million pieces. I sadly noticed that you couldn't seem to care less if we broke up. I remember you would keep telling me that lie that we'd be together forever. You helped me realize forever was just a word. Forever was a misleading word that brought false hope. Regardless, we ended it. I truly thought you were the one. We both did. I noticed myself listening to sad music on repeat for days. No matter how hard I tried to forget, I simply couldn't. I noticed myself staying in bed all day, crying all night, doing everything I promised myself I wouldn't do. I noticed myself checking my phone over and over again, just to see if you messaged me, having the constant urge to message or check up on you. I noticed myself missing every little thing about you, your silly faces, your long tight hugs, and your spontaneous personality, everything. I noticed you sitting there across the cafeteria and I noticed that I was still in love with you.